Hello everyone, welcome to Registech. Myself Karthik Punnuswami. You are at the right place to learn in and out of Java concepts. If you guys are very new to our channel, please consider subscribe to it and don't miss to watch till the end of this okay. video. We are going to learn about what are the difference between array list and linked list in Java. So this is one of the most popular entry question when you go for a Java interview and both array list and linked list are comes under collection framework but there are some differences and based on the differences we have to choose which one we want for our real time programming let's get started array list and linked list so i have written a point so here so just to make it very clear and easy to understand and remember it so array list if you the, think about array list, the underlying data structure is global array. But if in case of linked list, the underlying data structure is double linked list. So the global array means array, array is like a static one, but array list is a, like a, a dynamic one, right? And in case of array list, the best choice is when you want to retrieve it. Because array list internally uh, implements the random access interface. So because of this one, you can able to easily retrieve it. If you use array list, then it is best choice to go for retrieval. And in case of linked list, the best choice is to insert or delete in the middle of our list. Okay, guys. So in case of uh, array list, the best choice is to retrieve the data, like get the data. In case of linked list, insert or delete in the middle of the program, uh, in middle of the uh, list. And in the worst choice of array list is if you want to insert or delete in the middle, the reason behind that is whenever you want to insert or delete something inside the array list, you have to the entire uh, the data will be shifted right uh, so that is the reason it is not advisable to go for array list if the frequent operation is insertion or deletion in the middle of the uh, list array list in terms of uh, linked list the worst choice is like you know basically go for a frequent retrieval if you have if you want to do multiple retrievals you don't want to go for a linked list and since uh, array list actually implements a, a random access it is very easy to get the retrieval process but actually array list implements the random access interface, but linked list doesn't uh, implement uh, random access. So because of this one, so basically manipulation takes more time. In terms of array list, since if you uh, just like simply add or remove a single element, it is going to shift the entire elements right inside the array list. So because of that, manipulation takes more time, but in case of linked list, the manipulation takes less time. So these are the main points I would think about, uh, basically the difference between array list and linked list. And if you guys get a question in your interview room, uh, just think about all the differences. And this table column, I believe, will give you a high level and also easy to grasp it, uh, to remember in the interview program. And uh, this is the main difference between array list and linked list. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys have understood the concept very clearly. But still, if you guys have any questions or any clarifications required, please post your comments in the comment section. And I will be more than happy to assist. Keep watching all our videos. There are a lot more videos to come. And if you guys like this video, please hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe to the channel and share with your friends. Don't forget to hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next interesting video guys.